Yeah, I came in with a saw. Ooh, yeah, I came in with a saw. Yeah, bitch, I flare red raw. Yeah, bitch, I flare red raw. Yeah. What's up, YouTube? Bitch, boy, videos. Bringing us a brand new top 10 places of the week. And if you guys didn't see the last top 10 I made, I told you guys at the end of the video that this one, I would have it to where the number one spot has the chance to play with me all day for whatever reason, if it's to make a video or just for fun, and also get a spot on my friends list. So, this is the top 10. And what I'm gonna do is have you guys vote for it. So at the end of the video, I'm gonna have a link in the description for you guys to vote on which clip you thought was the best one. So the way I have them right now is in no specific order. I'm just showing you guys. But also, this top 10 has 13 clips. And the reason for that is because there were so many good ones and I couldn't leave any out. So yeah, these 13 clips are the best ones I got this week. And without wasting any more time, let's get right into it. So coming at number 13, we got WGO Exposed and he sees him to get the ball on court, but then he's gonna like be confused and hesitate with it and have no one to pass it to. So he's gonna throw it to himself and do the simplest lob to finish it for game point. And the reason I put this in is because I've never seen this before. And I want you guys to let me know if you ever seen this because I swear he was like pretty far back too. And then he just like throws it up and does the most extra play I've ever seen. And number 12, we got AOB Shucks and he sees him to drive. Bang! And then get the double contact and go right after he jumps over him. And I put this in before in another top 10, but this one was just specifically better because right after he jumped over him, this dude just <laughs> got in the way and then fell as well for the double content dunk jump man animation. So yeah, good stuff. And also, as always, I'm going to have everyone's link in the description. So go check them out, guys, because they honestly deserve more support than they get. And also, these videos wouldn't be possible without them. So yeah, if you have time, just go check them out and show some love. At number 11, we got Live Like Brian, and he's using to get up with a step back. Ma! on the superstar five jet pack and just look at it again he's gonna step back and get the open lane for the straight body on this dude with the fat jet pack and the reason i put this in is because as you guys know it's super rare that there's even superstar fives but to have one get posted like this is just disgusting at the intense part we got a new like and you see he's dribbling a little bit but there's gonna step back drop behind the backdrop for the green bean bang and the reason i put this in is because as you guys know I love double anchor burgers and I still have yet to get one and this dude just does like nothing without even the grand badge and then steps back for the green bean but yeah just take a look at it again he even went to his defender and stepped back wasn't even holding him and right after behind the back momentum for the bang and then he even break dances for disrespect after number nine spot we got V clank and you see he's just gonna dribble up by a lot so when I pull up for the green bean break I swear to get I got a few green lights that were missed, but the reason I put this one is because look how look how broke this stuff is. Like usually if you miss a green you could tell it's gonna be off, but this one just hits the rim and there's a fakest bounce ever just to miss. But yeah, dude, I really don't get what's the point of making sharp if you're just gonna miss greens. And I hope next year there's not even one that's missed. Because this year supposedly it wasn't even possible, but here it is. After the main spot, we got Johnny 1000, and you see his teammates can get the ball. Be a broke boy, so he's going to clean it up with the nasty 360 cradle putback over his defender. And I just like how he glided his ass in the air and just jumped super smooth to grab it high in the air and then just jump over his dude like nothing. And I think I got this animation like once, but not even close to jumping over like this dude. But yeah, I think this is the only putback in the top 10. So y'all let me know if y'all like this one, because I honestly think this is like one of my favorite ones. At the number 7 spot, we got Jump Trap, and you see he has his grand bash, so why not break some ankles? Step back, momentum behind the back, drop, step back, drop, and then look, his teammate even gets his shit broke because the dude fell on his ass, but god damn, look at this again. I mean, I consider this a triple anchor break, I don't know about y'all, but let me know what y'all think, because he dropped two dudes, and then the first one that dropped hit his teammate, and you can clearly see his ass got affected by it, and I'd call it a triple anchor breaker, but y'all let me know what y'all think. At the number 6 spot, we got Trap Kills, and this guy has a grand badge as well, so his team is going to give him the ball, step back, behind the back. Kill his ass twice like Allen Iverson did. Oh my god, he didn't even let him get out that first animation. He just went straight to it and put him in the second to drop him. We'll look at it again, if you guys don't know what I mean. He was still in the first animation, and then right after he did the behind the back, just put him in that old 2K16 animation and dished it out for the easy dime. At the number 5 spot, we got Limitless Shooter. And his teammates can give him the ball, so I don't know why he would drive up, but oh, I guess because the shot clock was running out. But, but he's gonna put a lip that I've never seen before, and I highly doubt you guys have seen this as well. But he's gonna break it, and his teammates can give him the ball so he can bang it. But dude, just look at it again. He completely bullied this dude in the orange jumpsuit, 
and I don't even know like <laughs> I remember I put a layup in the last top 10 and people said it was because it was a micro animation and like they get injured from it but I guess this is the only thing I could think of because just look at it again he didn't even hit him that hard this dude kind of like flopped but you can tell that was a real animation and yeah, I don't even know if this is supposed to be in the park. But either way, he still got the ball and banged it. So yeah, good stuff, dude. At the number four spot, we got Coldest Live. And this is Grand Bass. So why not come down the court real smoothly to snatch back. Double anchor breaker. And look at it again. I don't know if you guys peeped that. But he has a hideous snatch back. And still managed to drop two people. Which again, I still haven't got. And yeah, dude, shout out to this guy. Because most people have that between the legs snatch back. And... This dude doesn't need it at all. Oh my god. And I love how both animations are different too. And the dude on the left wasn't even holding him. He just got caught up in it. But yeah. Then he just dishes it out for the easy dunk for game. At the number two spot, we got Jaden Penn. And if you look at his grand badge under his player, you see clearly he's a glass cleaner. But he's in a drive for the open lane. And get the ma! Spider Man animation with his fucking big ass. And just completely shatter this slash's poor leg. And. I don't get what happened, dude. Like, look, he, he has posters on bronze. And I don't get how he got this Spider-Man animation when I've only got it once. I'm just going to assume he was a 7-3, but oh my god. Look at it again, how slow he went up. And then he puts his big ass on the rim and hangs upside down like Spider-Man. And yeah, this is the first time I've ever seen this. And probably even the last. At the number two spot, we got Required Truth. And if you look under him, he's a slasher. So he's going to drive for the dunk. But they're gonna do a little spin and pick up his dribble, and this dude's gonna keep going and break his shit and fall to the floor, dude. Like, I honestly have never seen this, and I didn't think it was possible. Broke him on a post move fake, dude. Look, I, you guys can't deny this. He didn't even touch him, he just stopped, and his ass just got on his knees and stayed there until he scored. But, dude, good stuff. I don't even. If you guys know exactly what happened, let me know, because. To me, it looks like he just did that spin and broke him on the post move, but oh my god. Alright y'all, so after number one spot, we got b and Chris. And just to let you guys know, again, this is not the actual number one. It's just the last clip in the countdown. You guys are going to vote for the number one spot, so yeah. At number one, we got b and Chris. And this clip is pretty long, but dude, just look at it. But yeah, he's going to come on the court, snatch back drop, and just sauce him up a little bit with his drip moves. And then get him again with the behind the back momentum for the green bean. And that's not it, y'all. The exact next play on the exact same dude. Snatch back. Drop his ass for the floor for the easy dunk. And that's still not it, y'all. The exact next play, same dude. After he gets his grand badge. <laughs> and I guess he didn't finish, but dude. He keeps going. He doesn't stop. And look at that behind the back. So clean. Finishes it, too. And it's still not over. He's coming back for the another murder. Bang. And that's still not it, y'all. Look at this dude trying to hold his nut and then <laughs> gets dropped still for the green bean. That's still not it. Holding his nuts. Bang. And finally he bricks it and is done killing this whole team of recyclers. But yeah, I'm gonna play this like a few more. I'm gonna play it two more times, but oh my god, I've never seen so many ankles in one clip in the same game on the same dude, too. And then he finished like all of them except for like two, but dude, good stuff. And for those that are wondering why I don't use my playmaker no more, I actually bought him out yesterday and I was garbage with them. I can't even play with them no more, so that's why I'm sticking to my slasher and all these videos, but I wish I could do this with my guy. And yeah, again, good stuff, dude. But yeah, guys, that's going to be for this video. Hope you guys enjoyed. And again, every single one of these clips has the chance to make it to number one spot. It's up to you guys who's going to be number one. So after you're done watching the video, please go in the description and vote who you guys thought deserves it. And which one was your favorite clip. So I'll probably announce the winner next week on Sunday, I guess. I'll give you guys a whole week. And for the winner, they're going to have a spot on my friends list. And also be able to play with me all day for whatever reason they want. If it's just for fun or a video, it's up to you. And also, this is not the last top 10. I just wanted to make this one special. So if you guys want to submit clips for the next top 10, all you have to do is upload your clip to YouTube as unlisted and send me the link to viewers 10 at gmail.com. And I promise to look at all the clips. And yeah, guys, that's basically it for this video. Hope you guys enjoyed. And I'll see you in the next one.